Hey guys, this is episode 120 of Minecraft Down Under. What are we going to be doing today? Well, we're actually going to be working on the rail system out the front of the base. I want to continue that. I've actually been doing a, a bunch of work out there that I want to continue on. Last episode, we were playing around with the uh, storage tank for the torture dungeon um, downstairs here. As you can see, I've done a little bit more work on getting... Uh, the walls complete i started on the roof didn't get too far on that yet but everything down here is coming along nicely yeah so we worked on the the tank and we we got all the the redstone worked out for what's going on with all that later on um yeah so anyway let's go ahead and get out of here real quick and we'll head on out the front and we'll get started on the the corner bit the tower that i want to do for the rail system um yeah, so let's go ahead and get out of here. I really got to put those stairs in. See, all that time working on the dungeon, I still haven't got proper stairs to get out of here yet. I'm a blooming Fruit Loop, I swear. So, what we'll do is I've already got some of the stuff that we're going to be using today out the front, so that's all good. We might need to come inside for some supplies, but it's no biggie. It's just, just really is no biggie. Um, as you can probably tell, I've still got that really nasty cold. It's dark outside. I've still got that nasty cold. Um, so, yeah, so I apologise about that. I'm really clogged up at the moment. So I'll quickly sleep in the bed, make it daytime so we don't have any whoopsie daisies, booms, bangs, or, or crazy stuff happen out there. So, alright. Now that should be all good. Get out the sword just in case there's any surprises. Oh, right. No bombs? Fantastic. Just worried that the creeper's going to come out of nowhere and take stuff out. Okay, so this is the thing that... Uh, this is the uh, the rail system, the path rail system, all combined into one um, uh, that I've been working on. As you can see, I've uh, repeated it quite a distance now. Now I want to set up the corner bit here. That's what I want to be working on. So I ended up, like, when I first started this, I got really frustrated because this section here, it was bugging me so, so much. This whole section right here was bugging me. I ended up going with them. Um, I ended up doing this, like, just making it so it's, like, flush. Goes up and over and up and over and up and over. I was going to put legs in here, but it just doesn't fit. doesn't work out. It looks really funny, so I ended up didn't, do, didn't doing that. This will go down to inside the base into the into the train station we will build in the main base. Up here, we're not really meant to come up here. This is for the the items. One, one side will be items and one side will be player, which was us. And yeah, so, and this is for running if we don't have a minecart. If the minecart would leave the station by accident and yeah, you know, that sort of stuff. So, I'm up to this section here. So, I got all the way down here and I stopped building and repeating what I was doing because the corner is coming up. What I want to do for the corners is put, is put like corner towers up, okay? Some some sort of tower up in the corner here. So in the tower you can literally it's pretty much a stop tower. So you come to a you come to a stop and you can continue going to the next tower. You'll be able to get up in the tower and all that good stuff um for and it will be able to make, you know, offshoots for 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 Bunny's watch as well and then yeah so I stopped it here because I'm trying to keep it away from the ocean as possible because I have you know I have plans to build stuff along the front here so I've got a th I'm trying to think ahead in the future so what I've done is stopped right here and this is pretty much smack bang where we're going to start it so I think first things first right here is probably going to be the wall this is so I counted four because you know there's, there's a four space between each of the pillars here so I I did another one, two, three, four, as you can see, and you know, this will be the wall, so it's all, it's all, all perfect. So, what I'm going to do is quickly grab out some nether brick here. We're going to also grab out some stews, and we're going to quickly just put in, what we'll do for now, we're going to put in another, go away you, should have topped up my chicken. There we go, so we'll just quickly go ahead and Really? This is five stairs all I got down here? No, 64. Oof. That was close. So what we'll do is just continue this out a little bit more. All the way across here. Get rid of that. And this will be as where it's connecting. Because it's not going to be a cobblestone tower. Because we're sort of going to... We're going to go for round for this. So can we go up a little bit more? Let's even get up here. There we go. Perfect, and then just uh, and then we'll, we'll we'll just stop there. That's perfect for now. 
Um, and we get our half slabs out. Get my half slabs. Alright, I guess I have to do a full turn. That's no problem. There, full turn. Connect. Thank you. Fantastic. Do the other side really quickly. So this will be the pillar. This is the wall, by the way. This is not really meant to be a pillar. It's a wall. I'm just trying to make sure everything connects quite nicely. And then we're going to... We're going to have to design up like an outdoor style feel tower. It's not going to be over hugely powerful because, you know, we don't want to, you know, overpowering the base having a huge tower built here. No, 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 no. Like a two story small open um, tower. That's what I'm thinking anyway. So we got those in. Dun, 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 dun. Scaffold up real quick. We should be able to fit, fit. Since we got a four block gap here, we'll be able to fit the arch in here on both sides so just mark it out real quick get out the wood here one two three four like that up like that do this on both sides real quick there we go fantastic ba bum do this side as well and hopefully then we can start this tower it should be really sh relatively straightforward we just really need to come up with a, a good look and design for this tower. There we go. Can we come? Okay, so that's the arch there. And then it goes into the wall. That is what I wanted to do. Now, we're going for an outdoor -y tower. So I'm going to be, instead of using a lot of, um, we're gonna, I'm going to go for oak leaves. And also cobblestone, which I don't have too much of, it, which we can go back and get some. Make sure we have some shees on me because, you know, any whoopsie daisies. So we're going to go for a roughly round tower. So what we'll do is I'm going to start off by placing... Yeah, okay, I'm going to go two out. And then I'm probably going to go two in with cobble, like that. Wait a sec, I'm just standing back having... I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, you know, processing. Go, 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 go. Um, and another two like that. Um, okay, so it's, as, as you can imagine, it's not going to be a huge tower, but it's going to be really open and airy like we've been doing it for this. So, you know, it's all got to blend together at the end of the day. It's all got to blend. Oh, one, two, three, four. Like that. One, two, three, four. Like that. One, two. Just take it all up. We'll play with this section here. So technically, this would be the corner. So that there... We'll get some more of this out. That there should be another tower there. I don't know how wide that is. We'll just... What is a four gap? So, one, two, three, four. Yes, it's a four gap. So, one, two, three, four. Boom. So, that there should be... Okay. All right. So, that there will be another offshoot. So, that will be going down towards the Guardian Farm, you know, once we start it. And, um, okay, yeah, so that's looking good. Now we'll quickly do the other side here so we can start going around. Block two. Actually, let's just mark the whole tower out. Now that now that I know what the corners are going to look like, we'll be marking out the rest. And then there's a pillar here with a four gap. So one, two, three, four. Boom, boom. And then two here. One, two. And then two here. Yeah, see, we're getting the round shape that I wanted. Well, that's not what I wanted. There. One, two. Well, yep, it's all lining up perfectly. One, two, three, four. One here. Then two in like that. And this should connect quite nicely. Boom, there you go. There's the rough outline of our, like, outdoory field tower. So let's go ahead and build this up really quickly. Just go right around. Oh, you fruit loop. Cobblestone. And we've got to incorporate a little bit more nether brick shortly, in which I've got an idea. We're going to probably put, you know, use stairs around the the outside there just to give it a little bit more of that bridgey feel. Pick it up. There we go. Pick this up. Last one. I'm going to take it up four blocks high, like that. Then we're going to work out how tall the, the second level's got to be. So we'll take that out. Oh, crikey. Ouch. Alright, scaffold up. Get, oh, we'll get rid of that later. Build this up real quick. 
A lot of rounds. Alright. And through this section. So pretty much as as I was saying, my goal is to have it just uh, like it's just all up in the air, all connected to one track. See, re a long, 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 long time ago, I used to have an overworld, uh, like, track selector built, and used to have all these tracks going off, like, different directions. It was crazy. There was just tracks everywhere. I don't really want to do that. I want to have just one main track that really goes around to all the main major builds and have stops. Like, this tower is meant to be a stop. This is where you can get off, get on, load stuff, and then continue on, or go back, whatever. That, that's the whole plan here, anyway. It's what I'm planning. Trust me, I've got to, got, to, got to pitch it in my head, you know. It doesn't sound all that crazy, but, you know, you guys know me. Time this is finished, time we get across the water as well, because this, this whole track system was going to be connected to the Mushu Island. That's, that's like the big plan, anyway. And then a stop off at the Guardian Farm when we start building that, because we've got to start thinking about starting that bad boy relatively soon i think we, we need to get a farm going again i've just been spending so much time on my base lately but i like doing that it's my favorite okay there so that there is our tower now what i'm going to do is get some stairs here and just sort of go around the outline here like so like that for our tower now i do not have Alright, we're going to have to, well, it's, the sun's going down, it's perfect time to go grab that bed anyway. We should be able to pick up a crafting table and some more resources. Ooh, I just need those stairs, really. I'm going to be burning through those stairs. I'm going to need slabs as well, because we're going to be doing the second floor out of slabs. So, well, there are the slabs right there. Just no stairs, that's okay. Quickly jump into bed. Just so no nasties pop out of us. I see you, Enderman, running around. Come here. Haha. -ha. Alright, okay, so we'll just grab some some stairs, another big stairs. And we've got plenty of slabs. So we'll just quickly grab some more nether brick, really. We'll just grab a bunch of it. And we'll grab four pieces of wood to get a crafting table. I'm not gonna hunt down freaking crafting table. I'm gonna have to do some more farming. Go away you, go away you. There we go. Um, I should just have a crafting table section for the filter, because I swear, if I make enough of them... Oh, what can I get rid of? What is there less of eight of these? I could sacrifice you. Bye. One, two, three, four. There we go. Okay, so what we need to do... Oh, there's one back out there. Oh, chicken, we will be right. We'll be right for this episode. We don't have to go upstairs and get chicken, which is no problem. Oh, soon we'll be able to take the train, which is fantastic. And the bed. No, I don't have enough room for the bed. Sacrifice the cobble. Alright, down here we go. So this should be relatively quite lit, because as you can see, each of this, each of these sections here, I think people are going to, OCDs are going to go nanas, because we've got one light here, and then the redstone block hidden behind it, but not in the center. Problem is, you're going to see the redstone block, aren't you? So it's, a, it's sort of a problem. So, I didn't go for that. And I don't want to double up the lamps. I think that's huge waste. An absolute huge waste. Alright. So, now we're down here. Go ahead and plop the bed down. Craft, get another crafting table. Boom, boom. Make some stairs up real quick. Just a metric butt ton of them. Just take that. And that. Okay. That should do, do us for now. We're just going to wrap this whole, there we go, like that, wrap it right around, as I said, this should be relatively straightforward, this tower, we shouldn't get too, too lost, it's really airy, that's what we're going for, we've got to incorporate some more of the, uh, uh, the dark oak fences as well, but since we've got them in there, we've got to have them in here, so maybe we can wrap, the doorways in them. What do I mean? Wrap the doorways like da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 like that. That's what I mean. Do that. See? No, that's looking nice, isn't it? Even do the front here. Obviously, so everything matches. Oh, where's me? Get me the shovel. And do each of the corners, and then we can start on the second floor. And then we'll have to light up down here. So down here, I'm thinking just having like another round bit and having the path go around and then out 
out and then out. So that's what I'm thinking. And then like a little water, water feature in the center with some flowers around it, something like that. Very straightforward. Nothing really has to go down here, I don't think. Second floor, that's where you can put the, the stop and everything else for the, for the rail. Okay, so what we'll end up doing, I think, is probably, if we can get away with it, so we'll, we'll keep those three there. What we'll do is try get up, scaffold up, scaffold up. Okay, so if we can get away with it, what we'll do is sort of make a 3D effect right around like that and we'll just use slabs all along the top here all right so just slab it up like that so fill the whole thing up completely shockers with slabs hang on i'm gonna, I'm gonna stand back and have a look yeah yeah see that's what i'm going for that's what I'm going to, I'll just sort of continue that afterwards, continue, yeah, okay, phew, I was like, what am I doing, what am I doing, it's going to look bad, but no, 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 that's, that's not bad, that's definitely not bad at all, I've got the effects that I'm going for, the slabs are not for monsters to spawn, it's just, I don't want to use full blocks, I'm trying to cut down on the blocks I'm using, because we don't want it to feel like an actual structure, like a, a full-blown room, we want more open, less blocks as possible, more of the fences and slabs, and, uh, bushes as possible so that's what i'm actually going for so just right from there crikey it's okay that's okay how many stacks we got on us that should do the entire floor anyway i'm not hugely concerned about that all right and then the track's going to run pretty much over this and then we got to do the second floor i'm thinking about putting a bush arch in here something like that leaving an open roof maybe arch the roof up as well not 100% sure, we'll get to that shortly, we'll get all that done, let me get this all filled in here, so, yeah. Alrighty then guys, as you can see, I've gone ahead and done the slabbing on the roof here, I've also gone ahead and put stairs around the edge here to make, give it that nicer look, so, oops, I missed this, hang on, so stairs, so as you can see, that is just a corner stair right there. And that's gave it a, a quite a nice look. And once I start, I'm even thinking about using some... I don't really want to go stairs in here. I think it might start getting... See, yeah, it's starting to get a little bit overpowering, which I don't want to do that. We can probably edge it. That is also another good idea we can play with later on when decorating. As I said, we've got fountain and we do all sorts of stuff in here um, once the tower itself is done. But now that is the first floor complete. And I'm thinking about changing these pillars out to cobblestone as well, just to match these. So it looks all like one unit. I'm not sure yet. So what we'll do is just scaffold up, actually. What we'll do is just install... A little bit of stairs here. There we go. So we can get up and down quite easily. So we're on the second floor now. Now I plan on continuing this up at least four more again. Four or five. So we'll just start with this section here. So give me some cobblestone. We'll just continue it right up. So we'll start with that. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom. Alright, so that's that done. That's going to continue right through the pillar. We'll keep going up, and then we'll start arching stuff. I have a plan on, like, arching this. So, why have, do I have tracks on me? No, I don't have tracks on me. Bugger! That's okay, we'll jump down shortly as soon as we got this done. And get some tracks and just make sure this curve here is going to work quite nicely. I'm just trying to make sure everything's going to fit, or else we're in obviously big trouble. Okay, there we go. Hopefully this looks good once it's complete. And oh, one more. Oh. So we've gone up by four. Yeah, 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 four, four, four. So then it matches the bottom. So four it is. There we go. Okay, so we'll quickly go get some the tracks and just continue them on through technically we're meant to have a, a redstone block there which we can put in i don't have it on me just so the tracks are powered so we'll grab a stack of tracks wham wham some normal and some redstone blocks to go along with it this is oh 
Ooh, this is coming along quite nicely. Might even give it a, a ring around the top. That's all good. So, I just don't block. Ooh, I'm going to have to fix that up. Goes there. So I can just turn the track on. It just comes to here. Turns. Um, yeah, well, quite the turns. So, there we go. And then just that goes out. Same with this side here, real quick. That stone block goes here. It's just to power the track, obviously. We're going to obviously put more stuff in here later on. There's meant to be a stop here, and there's meant to be other stuff on the second floor, but I'm not too bothered about that at this time. I just want to get the what this rough tower is going to actually look like at the end of the day. That's my main concern, and that's going to continue running. It's absolutely fantastic. Probably put a little skylight or something in here. So, let's attempt like to do uh, an arch I suppose in here so what we'll do is scaffold on up just go for all up put one in there and then we just sort of start bringing I don't want to make it too big so I think that will do fantastic I just gotta I'm gonna be like eyeing it just to see how this is going so I'll be up, down, up, down, up, and down like a plumbing pork chop. But that's okay. That is okay. Might have to go up by another one. Just so it's a little bit taller. Alright. That is pretty much what I'm going for. Yeah, I think that's pretty much what I'm going for. Might come back by one. And break this. Back by one. I'm gonna have to just keep doing this until I've got it. One, that's right, we're gonna grab one more. So that's arch is not too overpowering. There we go. Might have to thicken it up. Might have to make it a double high there. And then put the thing over the top of it. Remember, I'm going for more of the leaves as possible, slabs as possible, not full blocks, okay? So what what we're gonna do now is sort of Build this up a little bit more, make it thicker at the top here. And I think if we can get away with it, use stairs and slabs on this. Dum dum. And then slabs on top. So we went up by two. And across here to the top. Like that. And then we're going to stand back, have a squeeze. Make sure she's coming along quite nicely. So stair, stair. And then we'll just slab it. So what we'll do is just continue to slab it right around real quick. No, no, we'll leave it alone. We'll leave it alone because this might come down. So put a slab in here. There we go. Like that. Yeah, see, that's what I'm going for. That is definitely what I'm going for there. Might continue the, the, the slabs like pretty much all the way around the top of it. So it's sort of arch, arch. We might be able to put something in here as well. Not 100% sure. But it's coming along quite nicely. Let's uh, continue that right, of, right around now. So I think I'll be able to get away with it if I get up there. It'll be easier to get up there anyway. So, cobblestone, where are you? Build this up by another. Build this up by another. Because for some reason I went bigger. There we go. And... It was stairs in the corner here, actually. Like that. And one more. Ah, this makes it a lot easier. And then slab. Um, whoa, okay, not that, not that easy, not that easy. <laughs> That's okay, that is okay. We're doing well, we're doing well. Alright, so. Just run it across like that. There, I win. Not really. And then just take that out, take that out. That's just the other side, right? Nope, not really. There. Now it matches the other side. Ha! Data wins. What? It was thicker there. Okay. Whoopsie. Easy. And really stuff that up really badly, too. Ha! There. Gotta make sure everything looks the same. No! Fine. Alright, cobblestone. Alright, let's do the rest of the tower real quick. Get this built up. Oh, 
Alrighty then guys, I am back and as you can see I've gone ahead and done the second floor here. I've gone right around the entire top and I like it, I like it a lot, which is fantastic. The sun is now going down, um, it's a little bit over here I've got to grab. So what I want to do is sort of bring it up in the middle now because I want to hang like chandeliers. I want to keep it open, don't want to put a roof, an actual roof roof on it, so that's what I'll be doing next. Last thing on it, then we can start decorating a banners on it lights galore but is she is coming along quite nicely is getting getting the feel that i really really want from it so we just need cobblestone for the next bit so what we'll do is we'll gonna get rid of this this is my scaffolding to get up there originally so don't stress there we go all right well that's fine we could oh crikey I was going to say, that's fine, we can start up there, but no, I get knocked off. Because I'm a Fruit Loop. That's okay. Take all this down. Get back up there, let's try that again. Alright. So all I want to do now is just sort of bring it up. We're going to waste some cobblestone on this, but that's okay. Uh, we'll take it up four or five blocks. It doesn't need to be big, because we're going to have a flat spot in the middle to hang the chandelier from. I'm just going to keep it all nice and open. I'll leave that alone now. So that will be one, two, three, four out. We'll probably have to go five up. We'll find out. So we're going to take this side up here in a second. Bam, that's another one. Bites the dust. Just keep on coming up. Like so. One more. So it looks like we will have to come up quite a bit more. I thought it might have been only four, but I guess we're going to have to go five instead. Just to make sure everything's good. So we'll do that one too. And as we sort of... I think... I'm going to, we're just going to take it up one more. Just one more, Data. Just one more. And then square it off. So that's the center. That's where the chandelier is going to be hanging from. We can put, like, more... Of the brick on top of it, maybe even shroud it in the oak leaves for the bushes. That's fine. We can all figure that out. Figure that out because I've got to do a little bit of decorating in this place. A little bit, not a huge amount. So just throw that up there, like that. Put another one on top of that bad boy. Just sort of go on up. There we go. Just take it right up. And then we've got one more side to do. This is looking real nice so far. So we'll do this last side here. And then that's it. Bob's your uncle. There we go. And yeah, as I said, waterfall down the bottom. We've got to find a way to do some some uh, natural lighting natural lighting up here. But uh, we'll figure all that out. I'm not too, too concerned at this stage. We're going to have to find where I stored the banners at. Here's in the chest near the bed. Not 100% sure on that one. So leave those alone now. Take this all the way down. Alright. Fantastic. Alright, so we do have redstone lamps. No, redstone. I mean, we have redstone blocks, not redstone lamps. I wonder if there's any in the chest. I did have some for the main path but we are definitely changing it up here see see that's got a nice flow to that already and it's really it's just gutted and we haven't got no outline for that yet it looks fantastic it's gonna it's gonna do what we want it to do pretty much that's what i'm trying to say it's definitely gonna do what we want it to do it's even got a nice front way look look to it it really does it's really nice and open which is exactly what i wanted Exactly. It doesn't look like much now, trust me. Once we decorated the whole joint, I think it's going to look absolutely fantastic. Alright, so we've got some redstone lamps. We're going to figure out how to start lighting the second floor up, which I'm going to try. Doing this got, gave me a quick idea of doing something like... Literally, something like that. Like sticking out the side like that. Hmm. Huh. We could even put a, just get more, like, trees, boom, and boom, stuff like that. 
See, and that well, that will make the sides glow quite nicely. Actually, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep that. Don't be too fussy on lighting this time. Put hang a chandelier down the middle, and take two dish, dish, dish. That should light up this whole area quite nicely. And the block's hidden. Take that. Take that. We'll probably move. Probably put some half slabs on top of it. We'll leave that for now. And we can even like do some. Have a look, see what this looks like as well. Like that. So we're adding more of the the, the dark oak fencing, like I wanted to. We can do that, see? Just little things like that make all the huge amount of difference. A huge amount of difference. You could do that just to give it that little bit extra colour. Just don't know how it's all going to work. But I like that. I like that a lot. Alright, fantastic. Corner units are in. Chandeliers I'm not 100% sure on yet. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching episode 129 of Minecraft Down Under, and I'll catch you all later. Thank you.